Hello, this is Travis from EvolvingDeveloper.com here with another demo video with one of the games I made back in 2015. I started the one game a month challenge. I haven't gotten to 12 games yet, but I did get several done. It was a good kickstart on my path for making games. This third game that I did in 2015 is called Infinite Zip. I wanted to learn a little bit more about uh, doing animation with the Monkey X framework. And all of the art was just, it's just like four or five, or I think it was eight total little box sketches that I did really terribly of a stick figure zip lining. Uh, it was a very simple game, single input, you tap to start, you tap to jump, and try not to fall. It's not exactly finished, this one doesn't have a real good goal. Uh, this was back before I really started teaching myself design, uh, game design, and giving game the goal to start with, but uh, here we go. So, yeah. Uh, just tap the screen to jump, survive long enough to win, tap the screen and hit enter to continue the game from this screen. Uh, I did better, actually, this year on putting instructions into the game, although these instructions are actually just a screenshot that I'm showing or I took a screenshot and I cropped it and then I edited it and put it tech put text over it because I hadn't figured out the fonts and text stuff and the default monkey X font and text is not not really nice. So here we go. You have a little zip liner and the animation changes as they're sliding along and you've got a little line that you go along and when you click or tap it jumps to the next one. This is a uh, procedurally generated zip line so that uh, it's not a course that I made. It's just the code makes it every single time. Camera is not that great. Uh, doesn't follow along as best exactly like it's supposed to. But yeah, when you get to the end of the line, it says you survived your zip line adventure. Congratulations. And then you can start over. This one did a little better starting over than the other ones. So you can go. Then if you don't, you miss your jump, and if you fall too far, the game realizes that you uh, fell to your untimely demise, and you didn't make it. So that is Infinite Zip. That was the third game I did back in 2015. I uh, had a lot of fun with it. Uh, it's really interesting as far as a kind of an infinite runner goes. I probably could change it just to, uh, to go on forever, change the difficulty, and measure your distance of how far you traveled and turn it into an actual infinite runner since right now it is poorly named but yeah that was third third game i did a lot of fun um could be improved learned a lot from it though all right that's it for now talk to you next time